Well, as we have mentioned for our Together We Rebuild campaign, we are replacing our Obscure Saints segment with a Reformer Saint of the Month, focusing on some of the saints who set out to repair and rebuild the church when reform was desperately needed. So for this month, we take a look at a saint who worked hard to end abuses in the clergy and encouraged priests to live more fully their vows. His impact was so powerful that he was eventually declared a doctor of the church. Let's find out more about our Reformer Saint of the Month. The Reformer Saint of the Month for February is St. Peter Damien. St. Peter Damien was born at Ravenna and having lost his parents when very young, was left in the charge of a brother in whose house he was treated more like a slave than a sibling. Another brother, who was archpriest of Ravenna, took pity on Peter and took him under his wing, sending him to good schools, and in time, Peter became a professor. Soon, Peter decided to leave his teaching and give himself completely to prayer with the Benedictines. Peter was very strict with himself. He fasted and spent many hours in prayer. Peter eventually became abbot of the Hermitage and founded five other communities. The Holy See periodically called on him to be a peacemaker or troubleshooter in disputes between clerics or abbeys or even government officials with Rome. Finally, Pope Stephen IX made Peter the Cardinal Bishop of Ostia. In this position, Peter worked hard to wipe out simony, the buying of church offices, and encouraged his priests to observe celibacy and urged even the diocesan clergy to live together and maintain scheduled prayer and religious observance. He wished to restore primitive discipline among religious and priests, warning against needless travel, violations of poverty, and too comfortable living. Pope Alexander II finally consented to the many requests by Peter to retire as Cardinal Bishop of Ostia, and Peter returned to his life as a monk. However, he was still called on to serve as a papal legate to settle disputes. When returning from such an assignment in Ravenna, he was overcome by a fever. With the monks gathered around him, saying the divine office, he died on February 22, 1072. In 1828, he was declared a doctor of the church. His feast day is celebrated on February 21st. Our thanks to our friends from Franciscan Media and the franciscanmedia.org website for providing us with information on our Reformer Saint of the Month. And you can go to the franciscanmedia.org website and check out the Saints of the Day page to find out more about St. Peter Damien and all the saints in February. Well, when we return after this short break, our Survey Says segment looks at the religious makeup of the new 116th Congress. Please stay with us. We'll be back in just a moment.